Hey everybody, this is Keith here of Euphoria Pictures. Welcome back to my channel. Right, so we've gotten another release from Sacred Bones Records uh, in conjunction with Screen Factory, I might add. And uh, again, it comes in another, another hardened black box, which is always great to see. And it is another John Carpenter movie. And uh, yeah, the film I'm talking about is Escape from New York. Uh, look at the artwork on this. It looks absolutely stunning. It really, really does. So for this video, it's going to be a very simple unboxing video. Uh, I'm not going to talk about the 4K transfer, just for the simple reason that the transfer on this movie uh, is the exact same as the Studio Canal release, and I've already spoken about it before. But the one thing I will say about it is, it is by far the best the film has ever looked. It translates so very well to 4K, uh, and I think if you're a big fan of John Carpenter, you are going to love the treatment that this film got on 4K. As, as, as every John Carpenter movie, every single film that he's brought out on 4K, every one of them looks absolutely stunning, and it, they continue to trend with Escape from New York. But what I will talk about on this release briefly is uh, the new Dolby Atmos soundtrack, uh, which was a massive surprise to me. I didn't think we were going to get a new uh, Atmos soundtrack, and I have to tell you folks, uh, what a surprise. Uh, it has to be one of the most immersive soundtracks I've ever heard for a film of this age. And uh, I was completely blown away by it. So I'll get, in, get, get into that now in a few minutes. So yes, this is going to be a simple unboxing video. Again, another John Carpenter release from Sacred Bones. And in case anyone's not really aware of it out there, they brought out a few of them. And I'm going to just briefly show you this quickly. So the first one, I think the first one they brought out was this one here. Was uh, Big, Trouble in Little, uh, Big Trouble in Little China. Uh, looks great, that. You've got the Poor Choc Chop Express in the cover. Then you've also got uh, Prince of Darkness, which uh, looks quite nice. And then you gosh, three Halloween releases. Now these Halloween releases, uh, these had gloss finishes to them, where the new one now, the Escape from New York, has a matte finish, just like the Prince of Darkness and uh, Big Trouble. And I'm happy that they went back to that because on these gloss releases, the paint start appealing and you, they start re uh, revealing the silver all through the entire box set. So I had to leave my three of them back when I got them. But thankfully I got three new ones and they all look great. So, uh, but I am happy that they're gone back to the mat. So, um, so yeah, that is Halloween three. Then you got also Halloween two. I love the artwork on that one. I think it looks great. And then you also got, of course, the first Halloween movie. Now, there is another one. They brought out uh, Day Live, but unfortunately I didn't get it and uh, they're going for crazy money at the moment, so I can't seem to find one. Now, on this, I'm going to just see if I can quickly show you, uh, but all of these films just look incredible when you put the spines up together. So I'm going to see if I can get it on camera there, but as you can see, they just pair up quite beautifully. So uh, they do look absolutely amazing when you do have them on the shelf. And again, hopefully someday I can pick up the... Uh, the they, they live uh, release uh hopefully someday please god i do so uh yeah let's uh unbox this escape from new york and i'll show you everything that's inside it, and then i'll come back and i'll just briefly sp uh, talk about the new dolby atmos soundtrack right so here we go escape from new york but before i get into opening this for you i just wanted to quickly add i did, I did show you this uh, these editions in the uh at the start of the video the halloweens and the big troubles and all that uh, if you do want to have a closer look at them i have done videos for it and i will leave the link in the description below uh please do check them out because uh they're definitely worthy of your time they look amazing so uh right let's get on to this one and uh yes digging on the artwork uh, it would have been nice if you could see his face but uh, other than that, I think it looks quite brilliant and it goes so well with the rest of the other editions. I do love the snake uh, going up there on his stomach. And uh, yeah, I can't, no complaints whatsoever. So like I said as well, this, they're going back to a matte finish on this, which is quite brilliant. You won't have any problems with uh, paint peeling, which is, uh, which is always a good thing. So uh, I will take us around to the spine of it there. So you have Escape from New York and you've got uh, Scream down there, Scream Factory. And uh, there's nothing on the back. You just have the logo down the bottom there of Sacred Bones. And uh, the same on the other side. So each side is the same. Nothing on the top, nothing at the bottom. So, uh, right, that is the artwork. Let's open it up and have a look inside. Uh, if it will open, that is. There we go. Right, so the first thing you will see now is the 7-inch vinyl. So I'll quickly take us around this one. And uh, each one of these releases do have unique uh, coloured um, coloured vinyls as well, which are quite beautiful. So it's the same artwork. And then around to the back, and then you've got uh, side A is the Escape from New York theme. And the side B is the 69th Street Bridge. So, uh, yeah, that is the 7-inch uh, the, the, the vinyl case. And then I will show you quickly the vinyl itself. And as you can see, it's a lovely blue and black kind of finish. 
which looks, which looks amazing. It really, really does. And then you have a slightly different colour scheme on the back as well. On the other side, side B, sorry. So, uh, yeah, that is the vinyl itself. So I'll just move that aside. And then on to the 4K release. Now, what's quite amazing about this, and a lot of people are not going to believe this, because Escape from New York is one of my favourite movies of all time. But this is the first time I've ever owned this film with the original artwork. I have it twice on Blu-ray. This is my third time on 4K. And yeah, this is the first time to ever get this original artwork. Even the DVD I have of it. Uh, I don't have the original artwork. So uh, this was a huge deal for me to get this artwork. I think it's by far the best artwork you can see for Escape from New York. So uh, I'll take us around to the spine of it then. Uh, and again, it just looks like every other kind of Scream Factory release, the spine of it. And uh, all these, I say, I say they all pair up very nicely together, them Scream Factory releases. So that is the back of it there. And uh, I'll just take his in, and that is all the features you do get with it. So it's absolutely jam packed. Uh, I haven't done a comparison on the uh, the Studio Canal release. Uh, I don't know if Screen Factory has more features. I honestly don't know. Uh, maybe someone in the comment section will let me know. And then right down there is a few of your technical aspects if you do want to check them out. So bring his right back out, and then we'll take the slipcase off and have a look at the. Yeah, it's the same artwork as well. So uh, I'm going to quickly run you through this as well. And then to the back. And then open her up. So the first thing you will see here, that is the Blu-ray uh, special features. And I'm uh, loving that artwork they put onto the disc with the handcuffs around the Statue of Liberty. Uh, that's pretty cool. Never seen that before. Uh, that is your Blu-ray disc. And that is your 4K release. So that is everything you get in this i've always said it they're very simple releases but there's just something about them they're just a very classy looking set and uh again hopefully they will continue uh bringing these out because uh i would love to get every one of john carpenter's movies in this kind of format so that is escape from new york Right folks, so there you have it. That is Escape from New York and it's very simple, but again, it's the boxes that actually sell them to me. It just looks, I think they look absolutely amazing and I do love the seven inch final that you get with it. And again, like I said in the, when I was showing the, doing the unboxing of it, uh, the first time to ever get that original artwork uh, is quite amazing considering how big of a fan I am of that movie. So, uh, yes, yeah, so I watched this last night. Uh, again, I, you know, I've said what I needed to say about the 4K transfer. It, it looks amazing and uh, you are going to love it. But uh, the Dolby Atmos soundtrack, I could not believe it. Uh, the, f the movie just started, the, the opening theme song, and I've never heard anything like it. I've never hear heard that theme song sound the way it sounded when it came out of my speakers. Uh, there was just a great sense of presence, and uh, I couldn't believe it. I just knew that just from the opening song, I was going to get something quite amazing when it comes to Dolby Atmos. Uh, then when the film kind of kicks off then and you got the, the lot of the helicopters in it uh, you know your overhead channels are just kicked into overdrive it is so consistent the overheads at the particularly for the first first half an hour of this movie uh, the, the overhead channels just do get a good work, workout and uh, some of the helicopters sound extraordinary and there is an incredible amount of surround activity as well Again, when you see the first 30 minutes, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. You know the scenes where he goes into New York. Uh, it just sounds it sounds amazing. It really, really does. Uh, the bass. <laughs> the bass on this is like nothing I've ever heard for a film of this age. I, I mean it. Um, there was a scene in this movie where he finds the, the, the crashed Air Force One. And for four minutes, there was just this bit of bass that was coming out. And I could see the entire room shaking. Uh, one would say that it might have been a bit too aggressive and thankfully it didn't happen too much uh, during the film because I don't know if my sound system could have taken it uh, but it was so unbelievably heavy the bass I never heard anything like it and uh, again such a massive surprise you know for a film like Escape from New York you're not expecting that kind of sound but again if you are looking to pick up a release for Escape from New York and you haven't got it on 4k I have to recommend the Scream Factory now, especially when you get that new Dolby Atmos soundtrack. It's just an unbelievable sense of atmosphere that you just don't, you don't hear 
too often with films of this age, of this age. and uh, I was completely blown away by it. It was like watching the movie for the first time again. It really was that good. So that is it, folks. That is my video, and uh, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this one because um, it really was a surprise with that Atmos soundtrack. So as per usual, if you did like this video, please do give it a thumbs up, and if you could do, leave a comment down below, and please share your thoughts on this movie and what you thought of this release of it. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you all again real soon with my next video. Until then, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.